We're here at Nash Square, the home of the Raleigh City Acorn, where it resides. I don't see it. Is it? It's not this square. How many squares are there downtown? Well, I know it's a good shot, but we got to get the acorn. We are going to bring you the news. Yeah, all things local all the time. We're getting in depth stories and coverage. You're going to love the news. Well, kind of. We're here at beautiful Nash Square in downtown Raleigh at the Acorn statue. That's right, John Acorn, one of the pillars of Raleigh, is memorialized here where we all... Oh, it's like an actual acorn? I, I just picked one. I don't, I don't know. Who is this? Josephus Daniels? I've never heard of him. After apologizing to the family of Josephus Daniels, I decided to suspend my search for the acorn briefly and do some interviews with people I knew I could find. The first was acorn creator David Benson owner of third place, man about town in Raleigh, hey. and the guy who made the city of Raleigh's acorn, right? Woo, yeah. Where do you start building a huge acorn? A uh, picture. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, if somebody gives you a picture of an acorn, you go, oh, yeah, I can do that, right? When, you, when they commissioned the art, the, the acorn, uh, yeah. for you, was the bar basically set at the light plus time tower? Like, you got to do better than that, that's it? Well, that's actually before. So ah, okay. the bar was set really low, so I set the bar really low for them. You so set the bar low have, for the light plus time right, tower. Right. So they wouldn't have any problems getting it in gotcha. later on. Every time the acorn gets dented, you get called in to yeah. fix it and, and pay it again, gotta, right? Yeah. Seems like a racket. I mean, it's sort of in your best interest that the thing gets dented, you know? Yeah, I guess it would, wouldn't it? Aren't it you wouldn't also look like that. Aren't you also the guy who cleans it? Yeah, Does yeah. it ever get dented during cleaning? Oh, it could. It possibly could. <laughs> what is the scale on the acorn? A thousand to one? I don't know. See, it's eight and a half feet, and yeah. if it was, uh, say, a three quarters of an inch. I mean, this would be like... 10 so to 1, and it's way bigger than that, right? Yeah, it's more like a... Well, let's see. I mean, we just put the math out there. We should be able to do it, but, you know. He was right. Between the two of us, we should have been able to do the math, but I wasn't really interested in the answer. I just thought it sounded like a smart question. One guy I knew who wouldn't throw me any brain busters was Raleigh City Councilman Bonner Gaylord. We talked earlier with David Benson, the maker of the Raleigh Acorn. Wait a minute, hold it. Is, is he wearing my glasses? Uh, anyway, carry on. You're familiar with this piece of art, right? Yes. And he said one of the things when he got it made was he had to present it to the city council. So I ask you, where in your platform running did you put you know, your ability to judge good art? Well, I uh, am a well-known artist. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that locally. A big part. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm a big part of the art scene. And uh, no, I, I'm, uh, I don't have any artistic credentials, and, but we do have an arts commission. You say it's an acorn. I say it's a tree the moment it falls off someone else's tree. How do we decide where in the stage the Raleigh acorn is? Indian leg wrestling. Indian leg wrestling? Yeah, that's how you decide any sort of acorn related dispute. Oh, that, that's, is that on the books? It, that's, that's city code. How does a typical Indian leg wrestling match start? Uh, you have to lay on your back and then you put one, each puts one leg up in the sure. air and then you lock legs like that and then you, you wrestle against each other. I wasn't quite sure if he was serious or if we had offended either Native Americans or people from India or both. I was pretty sure if Indian leg wrestling were part of Raleigh City Code, it probably needed to be updated. You think this acorn is here to stay? I mean, you think in 100 years from now we'll still be dropping an acorn or you guys got something else your sleeve or you, do you think it'll update or has it become a, a tradition? It'll be an acorn, but it may be an acorn 2.0, okay. the next evolution of the acorn. Is that is that an exclusive? Are you telling me that's in the works? Well, I, I'm, I'm not going to say it's not in the okay. works. Okay, all right, that's fair I can't fair really talk about acorn-related secrets. I wasn't able to pry any secrets about the acorn, but I was able to find it downtown in Moore Square in all its glory, desperately in need of another cleaning. And I know just the guy.